Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this interesting algebra problem, so which number is larger? So on the left hand side 22 to the 33rd power and on the right hand side 33 to the 22nd power. And we need to compare these two numbers. How can we do this? Of course we, can, we don't need to raise this to the 33 power and 22, we need to use a little bit trick right here and I want to share you with this, I want to share you with this trick. So take a look, 22 to the 33rd power and of course here 33 to the 22nd power. As you can see right here, 33 and 22 is really good powers because we can take 11th root from both of the side. If we take this 11th root from both of the side, because 11 divided, it can be divided by 33. Take a look what we will have. 22 to the power 33 over 11. And of course 33 to the power 22 over 11. So I hope you understand this, because if you don't understand why I write this in our denominator, for example, if we have, for example, a cubes root a to the power a squared cubes root. So we can write it as a to the power 2 third. So this 3 goes to our to our denominator. So I write this right here 11, right here 11, and right here this 11. I hope you understand this, this step. If we divide 33 by 11, we will have 3. So take a look what we will have, 22 to the third power, and on the right hand side we will have 33 square. So as you can see, after this simple step, we just get only 22 cube and 33 square. So we need to compare these, these two numbers. So let's not like raise to the third power, let's write this 22 as 22 cube, let's write as 22 times 22 and times 22 and 33 of course as 33 times 33. So we just raise this to the third power and to the second power. What are we going to do next? Take a look, one of these 22 is really good, one of these 22, it's really good to write as 2 times 11, so one of these. And right here 33, it's really good to write as 3 times 11. So we will have one more 33, this is one 33, this is the second 33, this is one 22, and we will have one, one right here once more, and right here once more, we'll have three parts. So, as you can see, we can divide, right here we have 2 times 11, and right here 3 times 11, so we can easily divide both sides by, by 11 times 11, by 11 times 11. So, right here, we will have 2 times 2 times 2 and times 11 times 11 times 11. We'll have all of these parts will be equal to 22 as right here. And right here we will have 3 times 3 times 11 and times 11. So we can easily cancel this. Right here one, both parts, and right here. So we will have 2 times 2 times 2 times 11 and 3 times 3 we'll have only this because we, ca we cancel this this and we will have only 3 times 3 and this this element. So how can we compare this? 2 times 2 4, 4 times 2 8, 8 times 11 we will have 88. And on the left hand side we will have 9. So nothing hard to say that left hand side will be greater than right hand side in every, in every step. So I hope you understand this explanation, of course right here 33 but doesn't, doesn't matter. I hope you understand this. If you don't, write your question in the comment, it will be really interesting to read it. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, put a thumbs up, I really appreciate it. And I do more and more math videos. So thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos.